what's the significance of uh, already clinching here with, with five to play? Um, you know, I think our stress level. You know, we don't got to um, go down to the wire to get a playoff spot. Um, now we just, you know, looking to, to stay sharp. You know, one of the things that's allowed us to have the success that we've had. Um, and try to finish it off and win the division. So. Dane, can you kind of paint a picture of what it was like in here when you guys came in? Did you guys celebrate or anything? Oh, I mean, we just like, I wouldn't say celebrate. You know, we but we did acknowledge the fact that it's a, um, a fifth straight year of being in the playoffs. Uh, it seems it hasn't been in the playoffs in five years, six years. So um, it's an accomplishment, you know, and it's something that, that we should, um, I guess, give ourselves a pat on the back about and acknowledge that we did that. We all shook hands and um, helped each other up and all that. But, I mean, you know, it's more work to be done. You guys are on a pretty good run, 17 of the last 20. I mean, is this team equipped for the playoffs maybe better than previous Portland teams? I think so. Um, you know, I think just because uh, the first half of the season we weren't how we are now, but we were pretty solid. You know, we had a lot of good moments. Uh, in the second half of the season, we've kind of grown into the team that we want to be. And, I think we are because of uh, how we've sustained it. Uh, like you said, 17 out of 20, 20 games is uh, fourth of the season. Uh, so I think it's happening at the right time. Uh, the way it's happening is uh, is well equipped to, to have success in the playoffs. You're getting it from uh, production from everybody. Uh, the ball movement, the defense. Um, how we able to you know put Myers in and he's giving us something. Put Caleb in, he's giving us something. Uh, Wade, the last game in Memphis, just you know first time jumping out there and he giving us something. So we we just depended on a lot of guys and I think it's a good sign for us to um, have some success in the playoffs. Game second straight game where the starters had to come back in late. Uh, is that a concern to you? Or what do you what do you attribute that to? Uh, I mean, it happens. You know, we've had some games where we didn't have to come back in. Guys came in and made shots. And you know, I think against a team like Memphis, sometimes it can be hard. You know, we missing shots and they just downhill playing hard, playing aggressive. Um, and they're going to give themselves a chance. And, you know, I thought you you can look at it two ways and say, all right, we, we blew a lead again and had to come back in the game. And you can give them credit for how hard they work. Uh, continuing to play. Uh, you know, maybe our energy and our, our focus slipped up a little bit and they took advantage of it, but um, like I said, it happens. First game. The next goal is clinching home court uh, without Ed and Mo for a while. And how much more of a challenge would that be without those two guys? I mean, I think, obviously, with those two on the floor, we're a better team. You know, they play a huge role in uh, what we do and, and why we've had success. But um, we got an opportunity to get it done. I think we're, we're still capable of doing it. Uh, we've had guys, like I just said, stepping up constantly. And, uh, when they're needed, they jump in and, and do what we need them to do. So I think because of that, we'll be able to get it done. Dan, that's a sixth straight game where you guys have kind of struggled from three. Do you change the game plan at all? the way you play when you're something like that or do you keep, keep trusting? I mean, y'all watch the game, we're getting great looks. You know, I don't think you change anything when you're getting high quality looks like we've been getting. Um, if anything, I think we should be encouraged because we still having success, we're still winning games um, and having good offensive ball movement and screening and you know, just a good rhythm to the game. Uh, the three just isn't going in, so you know the fact that we're winning without making as many threes as we would like to is a good sign. Um, and also knowing that when this happens, it comes back around. And hopefully, um, when we get in the playoffs, it'll, it'll hit again and it'll be right on time. Is there any game on this trip that you're kind of really looking forward to? All of them. Um, you know, I think it's a chance to, to win the season series against San Antonio. We haven't won a game against Houston. Um, we can sweep the house. Uh, I guess uh, get our 49th win, closer to 50. You know, each game has some type of significance. So uh, I'm looking forward to all of them. You know, we get the job done on this. You know, maybe we get some rest to, to finish up and get ready for it.